job. She's so crazy, it's like her head is going to fall off. My name is Kate Higgins and I am a voice actor. There's Barbie. And Barbie's kind of really just like this, only she's a little peppier. <laughs> I do a puppy for Fisher Price, who's kind of their central figure for all their toys, and he teaches everybody everything, and he's the learning puppy. Every once in a while, you know, in video games, you have to do many different voices so many times. There is like Russian spy or something like that. Uh, and then, uh, you know, my monster truck, Starlock, she's on this show, Blaze, Blaze in the Monster Machine. And I'm constantly going, yee-haw! Well, normally they have a character description. It's harder when it's like a, a strange creature that you wouldn't know what it talks like. Or, you know, what, is a, what does a gopher <laughs> talk like? Gophers don't really talk, in case y'all are wondering. <laughs> they don't really talk. So we have to give them a voice. So I usually look at the picture. They usually give you some graphics, you know, and I look at the picture and maybe he's chubby and, you know, then you do your tape like this and then you get some kind of voice. If you're voice matching a living person that you can see, you know, then I try to really like be that person, you know, be in that person's skin. And I'm actually the voice of Aurora. That's something I'm kind of proud of because I actually had to voice match the original Sleeping Beauty. So there was an original a long yeah. time ago, and then that person died and someone else did it, and then that person, now I'm doing it. So like I'm the third person, and it's kind of an honor. It's quite lovely, it's like a, it's like a Catherine Hepburn type voice, a young Catherine Hepburn, you know, East Coast. I would say the community and the relationships, that's the most rewarding part. And every day is different, you know, it's never boring. Every day you're at a different job, so there's no sort of just routine thing. And then the second rewarding thing, I think, is uh, the money company. It is nice to get paid for doing something so fun. That's incredibly rewarding. It's been really rewarding in the whole world of the kids and the fans that just I mean, sounds kind of cheesy, but I mean, like, I get a lot of emails from fans that are just like, you've inspired me to, you know, do my best, or, you know, I, I have autism, but because of this show, now I believe that I can, whatever, write a play. It's a lot of people that are very moved by their favorite cartoon character that you voice, and so they have a connection with the voice, the person. And that, that's rewarding. Please subscribe to Verite VoiceOver on YouTube. I know you know how to go to YouTube on your computer, okay? So don't act like you don't know how. Do it, okay? You're gonna be very happy you did. Very. Mm -hmm. A woman from Disney was there. She said, you have such a great voice for voiceover. Do you do voiceover? And I said, voice what? I didn't even know what it was.